Sometimes getting traffic to your website can be really difficult. So what if you just had a list of websites that you already know will send targeted traffic to your website fast? Well, as part of my mission to become the world's most ethical and trustworthy marketer, as long as that might take, here are my five best traffic sources that I personally use. And if your content is good enough, you really can get high quality traffic to your website today. Now, the first traffic source I've got for you is called Scoop It, and it receives 2 million visitors every month. And it's made up of these communities that are formed around curated content. Now, it has thousands of these groups for, well, every niche and it invites you to submit your best content to them. Then the community will share and recommend your content and if it's good enough then you will be rewarded and featured on high traffic niche dedicated boards that have millions of visitors. And this is how it works. So we have a search bar here so you can search for your niche or you can click this menu and choose from one of the major boards here. So if we have a look at health, you'll see that this board has already got four and a half million views. If we scroll down, we can see the type of content that is performing well on this board. Now, how do you get your content on here? All these posts come from smaller boards. So if we click on this, content from this smaller board is being pulled to this one. If we have a look at this one, same again. So what you need to do is get your content published on these small boards first. And you can do that by pasting your link into the suggest box. And then that will be sent to the editors and they will decide whether it will be featured here or not. And if enough people find value in your content, then it will eventually float to the top of this board. The next traffic source I've got for you is called Tumblr. And that receives over 300 million visitors every month. It's a powerful microblogging site that invites you to share links, articles, videos, pictures, you name it. You can post anything you like on this platform and the best posts rise to the top and then receive even more exposure. Now, Tumblr is an engagement powerhouse. If you strike the right chord, your content really can go viral. So if we have a look at what posts tend to work well in your chosen niche, I've gone for health. We can see that the engagement level is crazy high. This one has got 68,000 comments, 45,000 likes, and 22,000 reblogs. Of course, that is the exception to the rule, but it just gives you an idea of how powerful this platform is. So to start using it, we have a navigation bar up here. Click on the edit icon, and then you can start publishing Next up is Reddit, and that receives over 1 billion visitors every month. Reddit is a content aggregator mixed with a social media network. So that means it's an incredibly powerful platform that can send targeted traffic very quickly. It's made up of thousands of communities for any topic you can think of. Now, Redditors are very savvy people they don't like marketers, they don't like marketing, and they don't like being sold to, but most communities or subreddits do allow some level of self-promotion if you get the balance right. So typically on most subreddits, you can submit one self-promotional post for every 10 high value posts you contribute, which is an okay deal in my book. At the top here, we have a search bar. 
So let's type in a niche. It could be health. What it's going to do is show you the top communities. And if you have a look here under each group, we can see the number of members. So this one health has got over a million members. Now, if we were to post on this subreddit, the first thing we need to do is check the rules. Every group or every sub Reddit is going to have slightly different rules. When you found one that's suitable for you, click create post, then decide which type. So you can have an article or a question. It could be images or videos. It can be a link or you can do some data discovery and run polls. Next up is bit shoot. And this receives over 30 million visitors a month. And it's the first real alternative to YouTube. And it's the most controversial site on this list. And that's because, well, almost anything goes on that platform. And OK, it's not going to replace YouTube anytime soon. But if you make videos, then this could be an extra marketing channel. And to upload, it's very simple. We click the upload icon, give your video title, a description, upload your video, upload a cover and then hit publish. Next up is Listly. Now with less than a million visitors a month, this platform is the smallest website on this list, but the community is highly engaged, at least when the content is good. Now Listly asks you to make niche specific lists that you can share with the community. And the great thing is you can make lists, well, about anything you like. So they can be blog posts, they can be affiliate products, they can be landing pages. I hope you can see how powerful that can be. Let me show you how powerful. If we have a look at some lists, we can see that this one has got over 200,000 views. This one has got over, over half a million views. And if we take a look at what these lists really look like, you can see that they're very simple. So all it is, is just a list of resources and you can add to this if you want to, or you can create your own to create your own. Just click the make a list button. It's going to allow you to give it a name, choose the layout, give it a good description, add keywords into both add relevant tags and then start adding items. Now, what if you want more traffic? Well, if you are serious about growing a popular and profitable website, I'm going to give you the traffic methods that I never share on YouTube or anywhere else. You can get them all completely for free when you go to profitcopilot.com slash traffic. And if you found this useful, give it a thumbs up below subscribe to the channel too, and hit that little notification bell so you never miss an update from me. And I will hopefully see you again in a couple of days time. Take care.